had a horrifying accident and fell into a vat of nuclear waste, transforming little Melvin into a hideously deformed creature of superhuman size and strength. Melvin became the Toxic Avenger. What is up, guys? Tyson Dela Cruz here. Thank you so much for rocking with me. This just in Donald Trump, president-elect Donald Trump, says the government knows exactly what's going on with these mystery drones, but they're not telling the truth. So he's also decided to cancel the trip to his uh, Bet Midster uh, golf course and home because these drones have been spotted flying all over his property. It seems like the American people have a big disconnect. The, gover the government knows what is happening. Look, our military knows where they took off from. If it's a garage, they can go right into that garage. They know where it came from and where it went. And for some reason, they don't want to comment. And I think they'd be better off saying what it is. Our military knows and our, our president knows. And for some reason, they want to keep people in suspense. I can't imagine it's the enemy, because if it was the enemy, they'd blast it out. Even if they were late, they'd blast it. Uh, something strange is going on. For some reason, they don't want to tell the people, and they should, because the people are really, I mean, they happen to be over Bedminster. We one should another the they're, they're, very, they're, very, they're very close to Bedminster. I think maybe I won't spend the weekend in Bedminster. <laughs> I've, I've decided to cancel my trip. Received, Shout out to everybody watching. Drop your comments down below. Smash the like button if you kindly would. About a video to or go, I spoke about this individual that recently came out on TikTok. He works for Saxon, who manufactures these drones or drones similar to this for the U.S. government via government contracts. John, John Saxon, or excuse me, John Ferguson openly had stated that, hey, these drones, uh, they're just based on his opinion, they're not posing any threat. Uh, let me share a little bit of that clip just to refresh some of the memory. I, from what we understand, they were out there trying to find this radioactive material. Now, drones, they have no reason to be in the air at night, unless you're doing some type of ISR work, intelligence surveillance reconnaissance. My guess, my own guess, is that these drones are not nefarious in intent. If they are, they are, but I doubt it. Um, but if they are our drones, the only reason why they would be flying and flying that low is because they're trying to smell something on the ground. That's it. Presumably these drones are HPGE drones uh, using high resolution uh, gamma ray kind of technology for uh, spectro spoke, uh, spectroscoping, excuse me, to detect uh, radioactive isotopes because this administration uh, lost a nuke. Here is an article from the Shore News Network. Radioactive material went missing in New Jersey. Shipment nuclear regulatory reports show a damaged shipping container and missing radioactive material are raising questions in New Jersey as authorities search for answers. A uh, small amount of radioactive material has gone missing in transit from New Jersey from a cancer treatment center, according to the reports of the Nuclear Regulatory Commission, the NRC. Uh, the shipment, which contained 0.267 MCIs of isotope GE68, was being sent for disposal in the container when the container was found compromised. Uh, the New Jersey Department of Environmental Protections uh, was notified the following day the incident was formally reported to the NRC on December 5th officials have classified this event less than a category three so less than a category three category three presumably is the highest level of radioactive material this is crazy if the uh this is absolutely crazy so what they're saying is hey you know uh we lost some radioactive material we can't find it this is why we have these drones in the air so why don't they just say something you know, why don't they just say, hey, you know, we lost something. We effed up. We effed up, guys. We're searching for radioactive material. Not not do what they're doing now. Excuse me. What they're doing now is saying, oh, don't worry about it. We just got, we know where these drones are coming from. Uh, but we don't know what they're doing. Just say it. Just say it. Hey. And then also in this article, the radioactive, if the radioactive source is not recovered in 30 days, in the case, the center will be required to submit a full written report detailing the root cause of corrective actions and prevent further incidences. So what they're basically saying is here, um, 
you know, it's not a high value threat. Uh, category three is defined by the I, uh, IAEI, the amount of radioactive material, which if not safely managed or securely protected, could cause permanent injury to a person handling it. So they're saying it's less than that. Uh, although the incident involves a small amount of radioactive material, which is unlikely unlikely to cause harm unless improperly handled for the uh, extended period of time, officials are working to ensure public safety and accountability. Just say that. Just say it. Just say, hey, man, we lost some radioactive material, but we're searching diligent, diligently to, to find it. But instead, they're just, they're, they're gaslighting the public. You know, they got thousands of drones flying in the air searching for radioactive material, and they don't want to say it because they don't want to scare the general public. But the general public is getting scared because they're seeing all these drones, and the Pentagon's coming out and saying, hey, don't worry about it. Yo, if drones are flying everywhere... They're looking for something and they're flying at night and they're looking for something. They're flying over Donald Trump's place in New Jersey and, and, and Donald Trump's saying, hey, listen, I'm canceling my plans. I'm not going to New Jersey uh, simply because the administration is lying and there's some radioactive material on the loose. Uh, this reminds me of a, uh, a spill that happened and caused some turtles to, teen, to turn Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So... Uh, I don't know if this radioactive, and coincidentally enough, it happened in New York. Uh, I'm not sure if there's enough radioactive material to cause uh, turtles to, to turn teenage mutant. Uh, that's just a joke, but uh, would be kind of cool, kind of not. But anyways, uh, just come out and say it. Just say, hey, listen. We lost some radioactive material and we're actively searching for it and we need your support. You'd get a lot more respect for that. Just like with, with, the, with the Hunter Biden, Joe, Joe Biden pardoning thing, okay? If he were to just come out, hey, yeah, I'm thinking about pardoning my son. Not lie to people, okay? Let me know what you guys think about this. Drop your comments down below. Smash the like button, share, subscribe, and as always, guys, I'll catch you on the next one.